This is the powerhouse. This is like the Battle Ganjar. This man. It is really the power of our sound and our band is the Yeraki. And without it, we're not King Stingray. This is Yeraki. Yeraki. Oh, Madapol. Yeraki has been like more than a thousand years. I'm using Romgo Kakalo. Paparo. Even Manike, music. Like Tango Baladai style. So I've got two Yurakis, one made of carbon fat and a wood. It's Kareka tree. I'm a Galpo person. Yeah, we have a culture through Yuraki and song lines. For me, just slowly learning, you know, because it takes maybe two, 25 years for all the secret ceremony business and stuff. Me, Dima, Yirnga and Yimala, we're all from a small place called Yirkala, or North East Arnhem Land, mm. It's a small remote community east of Darwin. So Yiraki's been traced back to this part of the world, you know, East Arnhem and Yungo people. Yeah, it's it's kind of like, it's the instrument of there. It's awesome. It's like, I don't know where the guitar comes from, but I know where the Yiraki comes from. Oh. This Yiraki, it's first Yodhi in the edit, maybe 28 years old now. Maybe it's been around the world. We're connected to a band called Yoti Indi, which were a big Australian indigenous rock band. They were the first really to bring that you know, contemporary and traditional Yungo music and merge them together and create Yungo world music. So my dad was the bass player for Yoti Indi. It's a really big part of our story and our upbringing because um, it's for our parents and our family members, for us and the other boys. When you're living in the bush, you don't have much professional exposure. Like, it's not like we had Spotify or any of that. So all you listen to is what your, your family members are playing and something's going in there, I guess. <laughs> Listening to your dandy. Yeah. <laughs> uh, walking around on the Ricky. The same time, yeah. learning that. Same for me too. The first songs <laughs> I ever learned on guitar were your Tindy songs. Mm. Those riffs, Marlicha. Yeah. Sonically, the guitar and the yuraki work really well together because there's these different frequencies and big sort of surf reverbs on the guitars and you get this big reverb on the yuraki. It's a pretty powerful thing, the relationship between those two instruments because of our family members and how they've played those instruments. It's really a special yuraki from Yoti India. Now we're on the road, King Sting right now. Gave okay, it the keys to a new life. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yurta, Yurta, rock star. Yeah. <laughs>